Good day. Welcome to Keymore's Everything. We have the Orion 60 watt 800 loom E26 RGBW bulb four pack. And I got this off of Amazon. You can see it's a color changing bulb. I've been using the Sing, Sing LED, kind of like they're very specific to Amazon. They only work with Amazon. I don't think with the work with Google now. So if you want to use this with both apps or both, uh, both devices, you want to get something like this. Uh, very inexpensive. Uh, actually, I'm really impressed with them. They're fairly bright compared to the same LED RGB bulbs and it has some kind of neat features, but you're going to have to download their app to install to Amazon Alexa uh, to get it to connect and be able to control it that way. Uh, instructions in here, they're wrong. Just wrong. So follow my instructions. We're going to go bring up our, uh, the AI dot, AI dot app off the App Store from your Apple or your Android phone. And once you install that, I'm going to walk you through this. So you bring up the AI dot app and you connect to the bulb. Then you connect to your Alexa and that'll get you working. Because otherwise you follow the instructions, you're going to be filling around for a long time. And I think the key is when you do this, uh, if you want to connect the E26, you'll see E26 bulb. Don't do that. You'll never get there. It doesn't work. You use A19, which is, or E19, A19 size bulb, and then it connects. But follow my instructions, get your phone out, and we're going to walk you through it right now. Whee! Okay, go to your app store, you got iPhone or Android, and the AI Dot Smart Home Life app, AI Dot Smart Home Life app, because you need this to connect to your bulb to your Alexa. And you can see once you install it, it's going to ask you if you can create a username and password. So go through that, put in your email address, put in your password two times. And then you can see I got a couple bulbs. But if you want to add, add a new bulb, the plus sign at the top right hand corner, click on that, and you want to add a device and you can see there's Orion here that's what these bulbs are don't click on that you'll waste your time it does a discovery it doesn't work at all but you see the top manually or nearby click on that as long as you got your bulb turned on make sure your bulb's been turned on and it'll blink two times at the end and go through its cycle colors uh, and if you do manually make sure you pick a19 bulb never detect as e26 you can see here it's seeing an a19 uh, Wi-Fi bulb and you can say uh, next step and you want to connect to your Wi-Fi. So pick your Wi-Fi. And you'll have to put your password in. I won't show you that, but you just put your password in for your Wi-Fi. And then it'll kind of go through discovery and connect it and all that fun stuff for you. And you can see it detected it and added it. And we're going to say done. And you can change the, change the name if you want, but we're going to do that later. We're going to do that through Alexa. And you can see I got a couple bulbs set up here. And I'm going to, just for fun, we'll click on one. I'll kind of show you. It's got some neat effects through the AI.app. Uh, the Alexa cannot do as many cool app to effects, but there's like fire, there's party, you know, you want different colors, things like that. I like kind of the fireplace kind of effect. It kind of makes like a blinking fireplace kind of thing there. It's kind of cool. Now we want to connect it to our, our Amazon. And what you're going to do, the AI.or at the very bottom, makes no sense, but that's the one you click on. And you do an integration. So click on that, and you can see you have integration. Click on that fellow, and then it takes you to uh, the Amazon. You can click on that, and it's going to ask for your Amazon uh, username and password. Put that in, and then it'll connect it to your uh, to your Amazon app. And you can see there's some bulbs. I click on the, the lights, and it'll kind of add your lights in there. But the only thing I'm going to do here, I'm going to change the name of the very bottom one because I don't like, I want something descriptive. But here you can see power it on. You can change the colors. You can't do all the cool stuff you can do, as you can do through the AI app. You can change the colors on it. And if you want to change the name, just click on edit name right under the, the weird name. And there you go. That's how you connect to the bulbs for the Orion, Orin, however you want to pronounce it. Uh, like I said, it's made by, I think Leesum is the actual company that makes it because I did find it on their website and it seems like that's the manufacturer of it. But to get it connect, you kind of go through some little hoops. Not too bad once you've done it once or twice, but the initial install, very difficult. I mean, I, I'm kind of amazed that, that uh, people have not got frustrated and sent all these back because it just, just doesn't seem like it works. But if you follow my instructions, it will work and I hope you guys enjoy it because ni they're nice bulbs once you get them connected. That's the hard part though. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That's you guys. Have a great day.